Hello, children. You know, I am getting very old now. I am 73 years old. Ah, so difficult to see. You are all fine, no? Today morning, you know what happened? I was sleeping here on the bed. And I saw I got up in the morning. I just slipped. I fell down. Oh, my back, my hand, everything is paining. Old, no? Very old. So paining. My daughter will always call and tell Amma, take care. When you get up, you take care. You have a stick in your hand. Stick. I thought stick is bad. No, stick is not good, no. But no, what she said is correct. Stick is good. Now I will buy a nice stick. I will tell my husband also to take stick. He is also old. I am also old. We can hold stick and get up, no. That will give some strength. Pray for me, no. Huh? I am very, very sad today. I am very sad. So I am sending this video to you. Call back is paining. You will pray for me, no? All of you, pray for me. I will buy a stick for my husband and for me. Both of us will hold stick and walk in the garden. Stick will give support. When I get up, I will hold the stick. And when I sit down, I will hold the stick. And it will help me. Yes, no? I will do that. Mm? Okay? So take care. Mm. Here, Lena Miss is back. The original Lena Miss. You must be thinking, what happened to Lena Miss? She's suddenly doing some acting. Yeah, I was doing a small acting. May that never happen to any of our grandparents that they fall, they break their bones, they have a pain in their hip. No, 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 no. Lord, protect all our old aged parents and grandparents. Today, I did that small acting because we are doing our last lesson in English. Lesson 10. And tail of a stick. Tail. T-A-L-E. Tail means a story. T-A-I-L means wall. Tail of a rabbit. Tail of an elephant. That is T-A-I-L. But this is T-A-L-E. And it is a tail of a stick. There are four pictures given here. One is a matchstick. This is a walking stick, this is a broom stick and this is also a stick but this is used for beating the drum, okay? To beat the drum, we have a big stick like that. And today we are going to read a lesson and understand the story of Tale of a Stick. It is a story of a stick. That's interesting, no? Yes, there are some characters in the story. There is a stick. There is a toad. Toad and frog both look like, you know, alike. But toad and frog is not same. I'll tell you the difference. Toad, they have got dry, rotty skin, you know. They have dry skin. But a frog has got moist, nananya skin. And frog lives more in water. But the toad lives on dry land more. Okay. And even their legs are different. Okay. Then we have a cat. We have a hen. And we have Farmer Brown. The name of the farmer is Farmer Brown. A cow and an old woman. One day stick walks along a road. Click, clack, clunk. When he meets toad. There is a sound that is made by the stick. And that is what we are reading. Click, clack. 
clunk, clunk, click, clack, clunk, click, clack, clunk. That's the way the stick works. Okay, stick. Hello, hello. Toad so green, do you need me? The stick is asking. Toad, do you need me? Toad, ribbit, dibbit, no, no, no. Ribbit, dibbit, no, no. Okay. Toad hops away. Soon, stick meets cat. The stick is first going to the toad and asking, do you need me? So, the toad says, no, no, I don't need you. Well, go, go, go. Stick. Hello, hello. Cat so puri, do you need me? He's asking the cat, do you need me, cat? And see what the cat says. Meow, no, no. Cat runs away by and by. Stick meets hen. Stick, hello, hello. Hen so cluckety, do you need me? Cluckety. Hmm? Hen, cluckety, cluck. No, no. How does the um, um, hen say? Cluckety, cluck. No, no. Hen starts to peck at stick with her beak. Stick. No, no, no. This is not for me. She also says it's not for me. Stick runs away from hen. Next, stick meets Farmer Brown. Farmer Brown is going home. Okay, he's going home with his cow. Stick. Hello, hello, Farmer Brown. Do you need me? Farmer Brown. Molly, Molly, I need you for my cows. Oh, Farmer Brown said, yes, I need you for my cows. And then I give cows in India, Jiana. Let's see. Farmer Brown grabs stick and smacks cow. He grabs the stick. Grabs the stick and smacks the stick. Stick and smacks the cow. Oh, radi kudu ko. Pado, 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 pado. To the cows. Cow. Mooch. Stick. No, no. This is not for me. Stick jumps out of Farmer Brown's hand and runs away. Clickety, clackety, clunk. Down the road. Click. And other stick, you know. Mr. Patella. That farmer Brown took him and gave the cow nice, you know, beatings. The stick did not like. He jumped from there and he came out on the road. And then something sweet happens. Shall we see what sweet is happening? Something very sweet is going to happen. Guess, guess. Look at the picture and guess. Hmm? Yeah. Soon. Stick meets an old woman. She is bent over. Okay? She's bent over and has a grey scarf. As I was wearing an off-white scarf on my head, a dupatta, a shawl, this woman had a grey scarf. You know what's a scarf? I'll show you what's a scarf. When you're feeling cold, you put your scarf on your head so that your ears are covered. And look at that picture. That woman is wearing a scarf. She is bent over and has a grey scarf. Stick. Hello, hello. Old lady, do you need me? Old woman. Oh, yes. Good day. Fine day. Lucky day. The old woman leans on stick to walk so. Stick says and then they go down the road together clickety clackety clunk clickety clackety clunk it's a beautiful story yes when we become old we all need some support if they have old people have their children or grandchildren around they are so happy yeah? Do you have your grandparents at home? Take care of them. One day we'll also become old. 
and they have taken care of us when we were young. Now it is our turn to look after them. So I hope you like the story of the stick. Yes, read the story well and we'll do the exercise and the notebook work. Okay, bye-bye.